Okay, so what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Wise. I got my mask on. <laughs> you know what it is. It's your boy Wise. And I'm back with another video. Now, I mean, this is a quick tip. Like, this, I'm so hype right now, you wouldn't even understand, like, how hype I am. I'm trying to get out the sun. But I'm so hype only because of the fact that I went to go work on the car. It was a Range Rover. Alternator died. Crazy situation with these cars. If you didn't know, now you know that the alts, the batteries, when they die, the car locks you out. You can't get in it. So I'm like, what am I gonna do? I mean, I'm gonna show you the car jacked up right now. Come tune in so I can give you an update on what I did though. I mean, it's real simple. It came out to be something real simple. You know, once you start thinking and using your head, you can do simple things, but I got it open. The hood is open, the car is open. But I'm gonna show you what I did real quick. And hopefully this can help you out. So check it out. HSC, as you can see, the battery's dead completely. The doors was locking me out. I got no power to the door. You know what I mean? No power to the door at all. Do not open up. Nothing. So, as you can see it's unlocked now. What I did. So, let me show you. You see, the door is locked. No power. You see? Nothing. But, but the, I was able to get in it unlocked that way. What I did, I started to take this fender lining out to get to the hood cable. As I'm doing that, I started thinking to myself, how can I get to this damn car to get some power? And it hit me. I'm about to change the alternator. Why not go straight direct to the alternator? The alternator wire is right there. It's 113. It's 113. 113. You take that wire off. I connect it. I got a jumper pack. You can use a, a set of cables in the car. I took the alternator wire out, connected the positive to it, connected to the chassis, supplied power to the car, was able to unlock it. 